here it says there is a vector r. And then they say which diagram does not represent r as two perpendicular components. Okay, winter 19, paper 1, 3, yeah. Okay, all the components are perpendicular, teacher, are we stuck? Not really, yeah. Remember the parallelogram? Ah, so the parallelogram is just moving the arrows around. So what I'll do is, um, if I'm doing this in the exam, I will actually uh, take a ruler, extend this line, try to make it as parallel to the bottom line as possible, extend this line, and then nicely connect the dots in a straight line. I guess I need a line tool for this stuff. I will connect it this way. Okay. Teacher, this one is like, look like the answer. Mm, yeah, it, it could be, could be, maybe, maybe. Okay. Okay. Doesn't mean the rest is wrong. So let us check out the rest. B, because they say not represent. So A represent, A is okay. B. I'm going to do the same thing roughly. So this is all just estimation. And if I were to draw that arrow again, okay, it so join the vertex of the parallelogram from where the arrows are pointing out. Okay, so whenever you draw a parallelogram, the vectors are being split. It's, it looks it looks a lot like resolving your vectors. Okay. This one, this one, look like the same. Eh? Uh, yeah, it's like you pull up and then you pull to the right. It's like then you pull in this direction. No? You pull slightly at an angle and this angle, you get this one. No? Oh, teacher, that also can. Can. i repeat. No? Copy, paste. Okay, what about you? My friend, and as you can tell, I'm not being very like precise with this. Just roughly only. If I need to eliminate some, I mean, unless they're all very close, la, then that's just my luck. Okay, so this one will be from here to here. This one looks a bit sketch, huh? Because it will be pointing downwards. What do you think? Pointing downwards, something like this. Ah, uh, so this one cannot, law. D, I think, okay. But let's just double check. So again, a ruler would be better suited for this, but I don't have one. So I'm going to just use my rough hand to draw. And if I check out this thing, Ta da Eh eh ah uh, that okay I think A, B and D are roughly all pointing in the same direction. Right? If you look at um A, B and D. So which one is not possible? C law, because C is at this weird angling down. Hmm. Nani? That does not represent. Okay, because R is like this. See, R is pointing out. Okay, so this is an example of using the parallelogram method. Or if you don't want a parallelogram, it's okay to just copy this arrow. I mean, copy this arrow and move it here, which is essentially drawing a parallelogram. Like it's the same picture, okay? Don't need to extra. All right. So this is the objective question.